Welcome back, this is Yam Jack, and today we got KF-L4D underscore N M underscore T H E A P A R T M E N T S. Suicidal. How are you guys doing today? I'm doing uh I'm doing terribly, okay? I'm gonna I'm gonna live I'm gonna I'm gonna level with you. I'm having a I'm having a horrible day, okay? My my entire day has been ruined from the from the outset, you know? I woke up, and uh, it's snowing today. It's the first snow that we're getting here. I woke up at uh, like 7 a.m. because I don't know. I couldn't get back to sleep, so I'm tired. You know, off off to a bad start already. And then it gets it gets worse. Okay, it gets worse. So I get up at seven. I'm tired. I want to go back to sleep, but like I just can't fall back asleep. So I get up. I go and I watch a bit of uh, YouTube. For a little while, and uh, have have a good time. It comes up to about 11 a.m. or so, and I'm like, man, I'm kind of hungry. It's snowing out, so I don't want to go out and get groceries. Um, and uh, you know, we don't we don't really have too much for food here. Just a lot of uh, burnt meats. So I was like, "All right, I'm gonna order some. I'm gonna order some sushi then, okay?" So I uh, I deliberate over my order for for a good, you know, 15 minutes. I uh, I I seek the uh, the help of friends to to help me uh, figure out what I want to get with my order. They uh, they they wreck. I was I was torn up. I I was getting some nigiri and uh, I didn't know. I didn't know if I wanted. Um, you know, if I if I wanted some some egg, some some sweet egg omelet, you know, or if I wanted some octopus, or if I wanted eel, I I I, I sought help from my friends, and they said I should get the eel, and I was like, yeah, you know what? Some some eel sounds like a sounds like a pretty fab idea right now. Honestly, it's I can I can get behind that. So I put the order in, and uh, I'm like, man, I got like. Some nice delicious sushi coming my way. It's nice, uh, you know, it's perfect weather to stay indoors, have like some delivery and uh, hot chocolate or something maybe, and then just kind of relax for the whole day. And then uh, the the restaurant that I ordered from closes down <laughs> for the day, and I don't get my order. They uh, they cancel it, and I get not money back, but I get skip credits. So I have I have money that I can use to order food. Which is like, I mean, I guess I was doing that, so like, it's fine. But at the same time, I'm, I don't really, like, that's what I wanted, and I can't get that. So, you know. So uh, my my whole day's been uh, devastated by uh, by this series of events. It's not actually that bad. I've offered to uh, to pay for some. For dinner tonight, um, another sushi restaurant opens up at three o'clock today. In a in a couple of hours, and they they stay open for for a few hours. You know they're not only open for like you know two minutes. They 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 remain open for a period of time. So I've, I've said, hey, you know, if, if we want to get dinner tonight, then uh, then I'll buy. But we got to get so we got to get sushi. Sushi is the only option. One way or the other, I'm getting sushi tonight. So I'm just I'm just being nice and, and letting my family. Join me with uh, with some sushi. My um, my mother and my father aren't particular fans of sushi, but uh, you know any any restaurant where you can get sushi is typically going to sell some you know bog standard uh, Japanese food. You can get some some stir fries or tempura, um, you know whatever you want, right? So they they can get some of that kind of garbage, and I can have sushi. My sister can have sushi. My dad might uh, fancy a little bit of uh, California roll or something, and it'll be it'll be a night of uh, of sushi, and maybe we'll play some some board games as well or something. I don't know. We'll uh, we'll see how it goes, but I'm I'm having sushi one way or the other. I think the plan tonight was to have some roast beef, the 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 burnt roast beef from the other day. Um, but in like a, uh, you know, beef dip or something, which I'm not interested in because it, it's gross. <laughs> so, 
One one way or the other, I'm getting sushi. They just uh, they're allowed to get it as well if they want, and I'm I'm sure they'll take it up on it. It's not like the beef needs to be used up immediately. It's fine. And uh, you know, free dinner I mean, from their perspective anyway. Free dinner is always nice, right? I recently uh, came into well, I didn't really come into money, but uh, my sister. So my sister owes me. Okay, well I guess we'll go back a little bit here. Um, a while ago, my sister needed money for something, and I can't remember what it was. I think it was like, uh, well, like it's it's been a number of things over the years actually that she's uh, she's borrowed money from me for, and uh, I'm pretty lenient when it comes to to lending money to people that that I trust. You know, I've I've talked about it before. If uh, if I lend you money, I, I don't really care. You you can pay it back whenever. If, if that's two years from now, three years from now, whatever. Uh, I am gonna be annoyed if um. I, I, I notice you making too many leisure purchases and not paying back your debt. That will be annoying. Like if if if, uh, if you owe me like a thousand dollars, and I see you buying like, you know, new stuff that's not really necessary. Like, I don't know, like uh, a new keyboard because you you want one or something. You know, some something like that. Or uh, you know, if you go on like a vacation or something, I'm gonna be a little bit less likely to lend you such a large amount of money in the future you know I'm fine with you taking your time to pay it off but uh, I, I appreciate it being paid off when when you can you know if you can't pay it off you can't pay it off if you don't have the money you don't have the money you know it's fine I was I was okay with with relinquishing that money when I when I lent it to you but I, I appreciate it being a little bit of a higher priority than uh, then, then you know, you you going for a vacation or something like that, you know, Sp spending money on stuff that you just didn't really need to spend money on, you know. It's uh, it'd be nice to, to have it back. Anyway, I lent my sister money like forever ago, and uh, over the years she's uh, continued to borrow money from me. Um, because previously I was in a much much better financial situation than she is, where she was back then. I was I was like much much better off. Nowadays it's kind of flipped. She's in a better situation because I don't have a job currently. Um, but but even now I'm not like hurting for money. Like if she pays back her debt, it's not like I get to go do anything with it. You know what I mean? Um, it's just like it's there. It's in savings or whatever, and doesn't doesn't really affect anything. Like I have to get a job and save up a, a, an enormous amount of money before I really get to, to move out, or you know have the YouTube stuff kind of take off, which is a dream come true. But uh, we'll see how all that works, right? Um. But any, anyway, anyway. Um. So I was like, whatever. You don't really have to, to worry about paying it back yet. It doesn't really affect me if I get it back. So just uh. You know, keep, keep it. I guess <laughs> it's fine. Um. Anyway, so so over the years, she uh, she borrowed quite a lot of money from me. Like uh, I think her 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 tab with the uh, with the Bank of Charlotte was was up to like twelve hundred or thirteen hundred dollars or something at one point. Uh, currently, it's down to like eight hundred or something. It was mostly like you know the cat has to get surgery, the cat has to get food, the cat has to have this stuff. It's not my cat. I like the cat. I'm not prepared to make any financial investments in the cat. You know, like I didn't agree to that kind of responsibility when we got the cat. I like the cat. I'll spend time with the cat. I'll, I'll help you know take care of the cat if it's necessary. But I uh, I stay very hands off. I don't like I don't feed the cat unless it's like absolutely necessary that I do. I don't uh, you know I don't pick up the cat. I don't let the cat in my room. Like it's uh, I like spending time with her, but like I am. I'm not a part of the <laughs> the cat raising thing, you know. Like I'm not prepared for that kind of financial responsibility. Um. So uh, she needed money, and I was like, you know, I'm happy to lend the money to to like pay for the cat surgeries and and stuff. Cause we got we got a cat from the uh, we got a cat from the, the 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 SPCA, and it wasn't necessarily in in you know. But she wasn't really necessarily um, in such great condition, you know. Still isn't, but uh, these days at least she's moderately healthy, I guess. She definitely wasn't uh, very good before, like a lot of like teeth problems and 
all kinds of stuff that I had to be paid for and, and my sister just kind of didn't have the money because it was like constantly one thing after the other and then she had like bills and and all kinds of other stuff right so I was like yeah whatever I'll pay for it you pay me back in like two years three years whatever when you can right like it doesn't really matter um it was just like a lot of that kind of stuff you know cat food and, and cat surgery and um you know like she wants like a, a car I think or maybe or something like that so uh anyway she she ended up uh borrowing quite a bit of money from me which is again totally fine and uh my mother ended up uh borrowing some money from her uh, to to get my father's Christmas gift and I pay rent to my uh to my mother which is like it's it's this weird thing right so uh, it, it is kind of the beauty of 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 like it, the economy right like like it's it's kind of a, a beautiful thing but so my sister owed me money my mother owed my sister money so and I as of uh, you know now owe my mother money because it's it's time to pay rent so I pay 400 bucks a month for rent and uh, I keep the 400 dollars that I would have paid for rent uh, and I take it out of my my sister's uh, tab with me and my sister takes it out of the, the tab that my mother has with her because like you know I would have paid my mother the, the $400 of rent my mother would have paid my sister the $400 that she owes her and then my sister would have paid me the $400 of, uh, of the rent that I initially paid my mom so like I just keep it and now like $1200 is like paid off you know what I mean $1200 of debt is paid off by the uh, the $400 of uh, me just keeping it in my bank account just just magically pays off $1200 worth of debt uh, you know kind of uh, cumulatively you know which is uh, a crazy thing but the the best part about it is that uh, like that rent I actually pay to my father like I I send it to my uh, to my father's uh, when I when I when I pay rent I I, uh, I e-transfer it to my father's account they have like a, my, my parents have like you know joint accounts and whatever right so it's uh, it's the same thing but just for like I don't know tax purposes or whatever they they prefer it to be sent to my father I don't think it makes a difference but um, that's that's what they prefer for I don't know I don't know if it's like tax purposes or if it's just easier for them or whatever like I don't I don't know I don't know they want me to send it to my father though because it just makes life easier for them somehow or other so I do so basically what ends up happening is my mother borrows four hundred dollars for my sister or like she borrows a bit more than that actually um, but my, my rent is only 400 bucks, so some of next month's rent is also kind of being caught up in this, uh, this weird sort of, like, triangle of debt. <laughs> um, but, uh, my mother borrows, like, you know, we'll, 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 we'll call it 500, I guess? I don't know, I don't know how much it is. Um, but my, my mother borrows, like, $500 for my sister to buy my father's gifts. And then I withhold five hundred dollars from my father, so that my mother can pay my sister back. And I'm like, yeah, it just kind of feels like he uh, he ended up buying the gift in a kind of roundabout way, and somehow also managed to pay off twelve hundred dollars worth of debt while doing it. And uh, it's kind of just got me. Well, I guess he wouldn't have paid off twelve hundred dollars because he would have bought it, and my mother wouldn't have been in debt. And my dad would have been in debt. And any, anyway, it's, it's kind of this this like. Just kind of a weird situation. Like, I don't really... My father ended up... Like, really, he was the one who ended up not getting the $400. Is Like, ultimately what happened is... My mother bought a Christmas present. My father didn't get the rent that I would have paid him this month. Um, which is, like... Kind of... I don't know. It's just... Uh, it's a weird thing. But that's the beauty of fine, of, uh, of the economy, right? Like, that's that. this is how it works. You know? It's, uh... That's why it's important for money to, to be in circulation, right? If you're hoarding money or whatever, it's it's not in circulation. That's no longer money. You know what I mean? Like, money is there to be spent. It's not there to be kept. If, if you're going to try and keep wealth, you should buy, like, things. 
stocks or um, you know gold real estate something like that like that's gonna keep you know um, equity but it, it's it's also gonna continue to kind of benefit the economy so but it was uh, so anyway I got, I got 400 bucks left uh, this month for my sister paying back her rent in a weird roundabout way um, yeah, I don't, I don't really, yeah, so I got, I got 400 bucks, a little bit extra, so I, uh, I figure, you know, whatever, you know, it's not an everyday thing, but, uh, yeah, I'm fine with paying for, for, for dinner tonight, so everybody can have, uh, something nice to eat, and, and I can have my sushi, that's really the important part, is I want my sushi, I want my dang eel, dude. I was deliberating over the decision, and uh, you know, I, I, I sought assistance. I got assistance, and uh, I didn't even get my eel. And it's 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 sickening, really, truly, it is. Episode two of uh, the Minecraft Let's Play, the vanilla Minecraft Let's Play, is currently, as of uh, me recording this. Uh, being uploaded by the time this video is live when you're watching this episode 2 will be live over on the new channel If you like the Minecraft series again, I'm gonna be plugging it a lot because I really I need I need people moving over there <laughs> I need people to know about it um, But episode 2 of the Minecraft series is live currently as of the time of you watching this You can go watch it on the new channel. There's a link to the new channel in the description ymjc.me slash YouTube capital Y capital T Head on over there. Watch the uh, the second episode. It's uh, it's a good episode. I gotta say, I'm pretty I'm pretty happy with what we accomplished in it. But it's live. Go watch it, okay? I put it towards the end because you guys are my uh, you guys are my faithful viewers. You're the ones who I uh, most want going over there. I never go down here, you know. Like I I know it exists. I never go down here though. It's like whenever you have a map in KF2, you got your you got your indoor area and you got your outdoor area. Typically, the outdoor area is just like you know better <laughs> in in like every possible respect because this this place is just suicide. What you're gonna try and like defend against this? <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. Reminds me of uh, if you guys watched Attack on Titan. It's just because it's like a subway, but if you guys watched Attack on Titan. You know what I'm talking about. I'm not going to spoil anything, okay? But uh, there's the one part where uh, the one person doesn't necessarily want to go underground. And, uh, you know, she ends up kind of not going underground. I'm not, I'm not spoiling anything, okay? I don't want to spoil. It's a great show. Attack on Titan. It's a, uh, an anime. It's a, it's a wonderful anime. The sound in, in, in Attack on Titan is like just phenomenal in my opinion and I don't think many people would uh, would debate that okay the sound direction in, uh, in attack on Titan is truly remarkable there's a new season 4 out right now I believe I uh, I'm very confused at what's happening I have read the manga but it's please I, w I want to I want to win there is uh, I've read the manga of course I'm a, I'm a av I'm an avid manga reader but, uh, hey, um, it's, it's been a while since I, I, I read it, so it's, and I don't, I don't think it's following the same story that the manga went on, I'm not, I'm not sure exactly, it's kind of got, it's kind of got me a little bit weirded out with, uh, with the first episode of, uh, season four, and, uh, I'm concerned, <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna have to read the manga again, I guess, to understand what's happening. Typically, manga are a lot. Uh... If if you care more about the story, I feel like the manga is typically a better experience, just just in general. When you have, uh... and that kind of goes for for anything with with movies and books, you know, if you have uh... any of that kind of stuff, you know, manga and anime, movies and books, you know, any anything of that sort. Where you have uh, a written media and then a uh, visual media, you know. Um, 
typically the written media will be more informative. You'll have uh, more like story to kind of enjoy. It'll be more descriptive. You'll learn more. You'll understand a bit better. Um, but the like the visual media, the anime, the movie, the show, the you know whatever you got is gonna be like just kind of cooler to watch. You know, it's more exciting. It's more active. It's easier to digest. You lose you lose some of the accuracy that you get with the uh, with the written media because you can kind of describe things a little bit better, but. In the, uh, in the in anime or something, you get you get to add in the it's like a whole different experience because you get to, to see the things happening, you get to see the characters like moving and reacting to things and like hear the music and the sounds and everything. It kind of makes it a much more interactive experience. And uh, we're gonna lure you right the heck over here. It makes it a very uh, different experience, but uh, I'm I'm partial to both. More partial to the manga, to in in general, I think, just because I feel like I I, I feel like the people who watch anime, I I I just I feel like anime is a little bit more mainstream. You know what I mean? It's not like a hipster kind of stuff where I'm like, ooh, I like anime. I don't like anime because too many people. It's too popular. No, no. But like when something's more mainstream, you get a lot more boobs. You get a lot more butts. And you, you, just, you just get a lot more fan service, Feeling you know? Generous. And uh, not for me so much. So so typically I prefer the manga where it's it's less mainstream. It's it's more of a... It's, it, there's, there's a lot less fan service. There's still fan service, but like... I don't know. I guess what it boils down to is in anime, they make the boobs jiggle. And in manga, they just put the boob there because they can't... There's no animation, you know? So it just feels less fan servicey. It feels less just obtuse. <laughs> so I, uh, I typically tend to prefer it. But Attack on Titan's not one for for much fan service at all. There is a little bit, but not much. They uh, they do kind of zoom in on uh, on butts at times, but what can you do? That's 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 what you you gotta put up with when you watch anime these days, you know. Anyway gonna do it thank you for watching remember to like the video if you like it subscribe to see more in the future comment if you to say and i'll see you next time go watch the new minecraft video as well over on the new channels in the description bye